I have to ask you this because I don't have to, but <laughs> this last month, I, <laughs> this last month I had a, a video that has got loads of views in Malaysia and yeah. it's got, it's got me something like 400 subscribers all from Malaysia, which I feel a bit bad about. I was mentioning to you before, because I feel like they clicked because of that one video, which was about Malaysia, then the rest of the stuff, they might still be in self-development. So just for those lovely Malaysian people, tell me your experiences about living in Malaysia, like the positives and how you find it. And as someone who's made yeah. Hijra or moved to Malaysia, just talk about that for a bit. Okay. So first things first is when I, I never really knew of Malaysia till I was like 11 or 12, but. Once I had come across it through the badminton scene, I was so happy that badminton players were Muslim. And I was seeing that their names were Muhammad this and Muhammad that. I was fascinated. I was like, oh, wow. So I started to look more into the country. And I always had that kind of inclination that Malaysia is a special place. Funnily enough, in my house, there was one Nasheed CD album who I thought they were Chinese brothers because I was only eight or nine when my mother bought the album. But they were Malaysians too. And that was the Rayhan album. And I actually learned those songs that were in Malay. <laughs> purely from listening to them so much, there was the sheet, purely from listening to them so much, but I actually thought it was Chinese. So I had a, a kind of an affinity for Malaysia already. <laughs> I was still ignorant at that time. I China. China. I there are Muslims in China too, obviously they're not there. I think there's more Muslims in China than in Malaysia. But I had that kind of affinity for Malaysia. And I think just when it came to the idea of being able to come to Malaysia, to be able to work, to have a network, it just happened naturally. And I think once I had that kind of goal and affinity, everything fell into place. From being here, I never have to worry about anything. If I go out, I know within five minutes, I can come across the cleanest, most beautiful, well-designed, peaceful masjid that you can think of just around the corner, wherever I am, I, I'm never struggling to look for places to pray. And I, being from England, where when you go to Tesco or you go to Asda and you're constantly checking the packets or all of the ingredients, what's in there? Can I have it? Can I not? I can't explain how liberating it is when you live in a Muslim country. They might not say they're a Muslim country. Where Muslim is the official religion, where Islam is the official religion, and there are Muslims everywhere. There are masjids everywhere. There's halal food everywhere. I can't explain how liberating that is, man. You feel totally at comfort because maybe there's a part of you which is calling out for home that you can only find in a place where there are lots of Muslims. Being here, especially, there is such a strong push for development here. I imagine that Malaysia is now like the way that the Emirates was in the 90s, where it was rapidly, I see that. I see Malaysia on a very rapid curve of growth. It's going places and it's fast. So people want to come here. Lots of people want to holiday here as they should. It is an amazing place. And there's a good mix of everything. There's a good mix of culture. That, mashallah, the lot of the Malaysians, they can speak multiple languages. Uh, the Muslim communities, versed in Islam, they're all Islam dear to their heart. So it's just wonderful to be, it's just wonderful to be in. And I can't speak highly enough of the country. I might not be here forever. I can say that openly. I might not be here forever. People who are wanting to make hijra or they're wanting to think of moving to a country, I would come for a holiday, try it out, see the people, think about work opportunities if you can get it. Think about any other opportunities to come and spend more time. It's a good place to be. It's a developing country. There's lots to do. People. Muslim is very easy to live here.